So Ben, what are some of the things that we think about in helping helping somebody determine how much it's going to cost to launch or create a brand? It all comes down to size. You know, okay. what if a uh, a little league reaches out for a, a rebrand? Like a whole league or just a team? Just a little league team. Okay, yeah, yeah, just a little league team. Yeah. Um, and then what if a multi-million dollar company reaches out? Or even out? multi-billion dollar company. Yeah, that's yeah. right. <laughs> yeah, I mean, would you expect that the worth of the brand of the individual little league team would be worth the same as the, you know, cost the same as the billion dollar industry? No, I mean, I wouldn't, <laughs> partly because the Little League team has far fewer resources. But right. is that all that matters? Like, it just like, oh, this company's got a lot of money, so they get charged right. a lot more. Is that is that how it works? That's right. Yeah, we just have this sliding scale like, oh, you, you've got a lot of money. We'll charge you more. Well, no, um, really, it comes down to, you know, think about with a Little League team, for example, they might need their logo on their jerseys maybe a little one page website with the uh, schedule on it or something like that. And that could be it. Yeah. You know, the the implementation of that brand um, is just, it's very limited yeah. and, and as it should be. There's no reason to make that more complex yeah. uh, than it needs to be. However, when you work with a multi-million, multi-billion dollar company, oh man, I mean, the, the ways in which that brand has to be implemented can be really, really uh, varied and robust. And, um, you know, we've we've dealt with that as we've worked on brands for bigger companies. It's crazy how many places the colors and the fonts and the logos um, need to be represented or the messaging. I mean, it just gets so, so, so big. And so it, it makes sense that it would really vary um, on the size of the entity. 